Good morning, guys. I've got a bad idea and I, don't be laughing. You get bad ideas too, except I'm going to do this one. I want to see which is faster around the oval, the drift wheels or the rubber tires. I know it sounds stupid, but I got to see it. Let's get to the table. More so than anything, I just want to see how much difference. Now, these rubber tires are actually off the Red Cat STK car. So, uh, I've got to see this. I don't know why. I just really need to see this. Something I got to try. I just got to go. Let's get outside. Okay, so, um, yeah, stupid, but I, I just got to find out. And I got to see if I can keep it within reason. So, here we go. <laughs> All I need is one good lap. That might that might have been my best lap right there. Come on, man, this is tougher than it looks. Come on, baby. Oh. <laughs> oh, come on. Oh, that wasn't the what I was after. Hey, this is fun, man. This is fun. Ah, all the way in the corner. I knew that was going to be bad. So I'm pretty sure that uh, the... Okay, I got to get a good lap in now. Come on. Wonder if I can drive slow and get a faster lap in than, than sliding it. I think it's actually faster just simply driving slow. Man, that was a good lap. That's not drifting. And I know the uh, hardcore drifters will be like, oh, oh, you're not drifting. That's four wheel drive. Yeah, I don't care. If I want to say I am sliding, I'm sliding. If I want to say I'm drifting, I'm drifting. If I want to say these paddles are doing great out here, these paddles are doing great. That was good. That was a good one. That was a good one right there. Oh, oh man. All right, I guess it's time to put on the uh, rubber tires because if not, I'll wear my battery down. Okay, rubber tires are on. I'm expecting this to be infinitely faster. Oh my goodness. Now these are off that red cat. Dude, holy cow, these tires stick. What's up with that? I'm gonna tell you guys something here. We already know what won, right? All right, I wanna tell you guys something. We've got plans if racing shows that it's gonna be good and if conditions are good. The game plan is 
the whole back side of this, the same with the front side. We're going to extend this out and give a nice embankment. Um, it'll be out, curvature all the way up and then back in. So at that point, the front and back stretch, however you wanna look at that, will be a full 60 foot, not about 40 feet. So, and this will be on both ends. You'll have basically NASCAR, like for real. Um, and as far as the embankment goes, personally, I wanna go for about 30 degrees. I want to have something where we can really just get on it and just ride it and just hold full throttle the entire time, man. Just run it. And if money is really good at that time, I have also have no problem with laying pavement on top of all this. So you basically lay the pavement on top of it, just like they do some of the real heavy roads like I-75. Because I, I remember when they put that down, they had concrete and they put the pavement over it, which is perfect. I guess that's normal, I don't know. But um, regardless, that would give us crazy, insane traction. And you can literally be able to hold full throttle around the entire thing, which is kind of what I'm after. Uh, just come across, roam, around through there and roam around the other side. So, um, and complete with that sound effect. So yeah, that's, that's the game plan. If it happens, uh, Jack's RC Recycle and Repair. That's the man right there, Sean Lorman. But that's one of the plans that we have for this place. Well, as it turns out, rubber tires are faster, but man, see, we're wanting to race drift wheels on this thing. At least I'm wanting to race drift wheels. Dudes, uh, going slow, getting those hard plastics to stick was way faster than sliding it. I mean, I'm learning a lot about the on-road thing. And I, if you're still watching, I filled you in on some of the game plan that we have with that track. If I can do the pavement on there, that would be insane traction, man. Just hold full throttle. Yeah, around just that would be insane, wouldn't it? The problem with that is if I make the embankments, if I somehow come up with the funds to do this, if I get the embankments the way I want them and I pave it, traction is there all the way. The it will up the level of the track that I've got by a hundred times which would bring in the more serious racers. And I'm not sure that I want that. The group of guys that we have out here racing right now is awesome. Fun, joking, having a great time. I like that. So anyway, guys, hope you enjoyed the video. Um, I learned a little bit of something about drifting. Don't slide, you're faster. Have a great day, guys. If you're still watching, you are top shelf. You are the cream of the crop, the pick of the litter. You are phenomenal. Thank you for watching to the end of the video. It means a lot to me. Now, down below, there are links for the products you see. Also, for channel memberships, if you guys want to be a part. Channel members get early viewing on pretty much everything that I can. So, guys, check that description. There's a lot of info down there. Thank you all for watching.